Hi everyone, my name is Dinesh. I am a student from University Two Nusenon, Malaysia. Okay, uh, my lecturer's name is Dr. Magat Satria Zainuddin Bin Yaqub, which teaches me the subject named artificial intelligence. So today I would like to, I I am requested to make a video, which actually teaches others regarding on depth first search for the given problem by my lecture. Okay, so these are the, so first let me explain to you all regarding on what is depth first search. Okay, depth first search is an algorithm for traversing or searching tree or graph data structures. So, it actually goes down like a tree, like a branching things. Okay, second is it uses stack data structure. Okay, the final one is it explores only one node. If you if you actually carefully under listen to what I have said just now is it goes like a branch. So if it goes like a branch, it goes to actually many options of undergoing. But for depth first search, we only focus on one node. Okay, so this is the problem which was given by my lecturer, which is water jug problem. Okay, this is the question. So uh, you are given two jugs. A 4 liter one and a 3 liter one. So there's two which is we can represent that by A is 4 liters, B is 3 liters. Okay, a pump which has unlimited water which you can use to fill the jug and the ground on which water may be poured. Neither jug has any measuring markings on it. How can you exactly get 2 liters of water in one jug and no water in another jug? Okay, so this is the steps and solution which I will be teaching to you. So, it is a water jug. So, this is A as what I have shown you just what I have told you just now. This is A represents 4 litre. This is B represents 3 litre. Actually, this picture is not a water jug, but I have just taken, is, taken this as an example. 4 litre, 3 litre. So, the initial state starts from 0, 0 where both the jugs will be empty. The goal state is we have to make sure that Jug A contains 2 litres of water, Jug B contains 0 litres of water, which is empty condition. Okay, there's three steps we have to actually focus on. Is one, we have to fill. Okay, this is the solution for depth first search. First is fill. You fill Jug 1, you fill Jug 2. Okay, the second is you empty Jug 1, you empty Jug 2. The third will be you transfer Jug 1 to Jug 2 or Jug 2 to Jug 1. So, this is this one. Okay, here we start regarding on the solution. Okay, it starts from 0, 0. As you can see here, starts from 0, 0. Okay, where both the jugs is empty. Okay, it starts from 0, 0. So, this left hand side 0 stands for the A jug. Right hand side 0 stands for the B jug. Okay, first what we do, since it is empty, we have to fill it up. Okay, but we fill it up only one. Okay, we fill it up with jug A 4 liters and we may let jug B to remain empty. Okay, the next is what we do, both these jugs, 4 and 0, we have to now make it transfer, we have to transfer it evenly to the other one. So, now what we do, 4 plus 0 equals to 4, am I right? So, 1 plus 3 is also equals to 4, so we have to transfer evenly. So, what we do, we take the 4, we divide to the both, so it becomes A jug contains 1 liter, B jug contains 3 liters of water. Okay, from this state, we have seen here, we have to empty it. Okay, what we do? We empty jug B. So, we remain jug A with 1 litre of water according to this and we empty jug B to 0. So, it becomes 1 to 0. The next is you have to transfer. Okay, you have to transfer. What we do? We take the jug, the 1 litre from jug A, we pour it to jug B. So, it becomes jug A is empty, jug B consists of 1 litre. Okay, now what we do, the next one is, we have to fill up jug A with 4 litres of water. So, it becomes jug A consists of 4 litres of water, jug B consists of 1 litres of water. So, what we do now, we go to the 4 plus 1 equals to 5, am I right? So, 2 plus 3 is, is, equal, is also equals to 5. So, what we do, this 4 and 1, we have to divide it, we have to give it evenly to both the jugs. So, Hence, we also have to focus on our goal state, which is 2, 0. Okay, what we do now is, we make our jug A to 2 liters. So, what we do, we remove 2 liters from jug A, so that we remain with 2 liters. We remove 2 liters and we include, we insert the 2 liter of removing 1 into jug B. So, it becomes 3 liters. Am I right? So, it is now 2 liters in jug A, 3 liters in jug B. 
so the last one is we have to empty jug b to reach our gold state which is 2 liter in a jug zero empty b jug so this is how we get the gold state starting from the initial states goes to the gold states this is actually it has to go by branches but i have just shown you straight from the initial to gold state so that you can understand it clearly so i hope you guys understand this from what i've learned and what i'm teaching you guys okay so here goes the credit session where i have to actually thank three of them first is deba kanan who actually also explained regarding on depth first search in the youtube second is cse girl she also posted a video on explanation regarding on depth first search so they both helped me actually for my reference the last but not least will be my lecturer dr magat satria zainuddin bin yakub who have given me this task and who have teach me regarding on depth first search and also given me a chance on teaching others regarding on this so that's all from me thank you very much